Hello everybody. I'm trying to get better at vlogging. I'm here in downtown Fullerton because I'm picking up Poncho's birthday cake. It's a couple days early, but I worked throughout the, the rest of the work week and today was the only day that they were open that I was able to pick up the cake. So I'm going there now to pick it up. He's turning eight this year and I don't know if I'm prepared to admit that I've had him for five years now. Yeah, because he was like three when I got him, I think. Which is crazy that he's eight years old now. And then I think George is turning two and Mason, and then Brody's turning three. So after I left the deli, I met up with a group of Pokemon catchers because we were trying to get Rayquaza and we defeated it, but it ran away. And this is always my luck. Anytime that I try to catch any Pokemon in Pokemon Go from the raid battles, they always freaking get away from me. And it always takes like four or five before I finally actually catch one. So I use my, all my raid passes for today. I usually like to keep like two stocks up, but I ran out of them because I wasted them because I'm stupid. So don't have any more. So I'm just gonna head home now with Poncho's cake and I'm trying to decide if I'm just gonna give it to him today. But I got a discount because I'm a regular customer there. So that's pretty cool. Oh, it's like discounts. So I'm on my way home now and then we're gonna do that. I wasn't filming so I just got home and I gave the cats a treat it's um something I got from the deli and it's a grain free um, treat for cats and it's a savory salmon recipe but it also includes cranberry and actually opening it it smells more like cranberry than fish um, but it's supposed to be really good for their digestive system um, and their urinary tract so I gave some to each one of the cats and Georgia and Mason were both like not about it at all. But then freaking Poncho over here, who's rubbing his face on everything, and Brody, the two old men in the group, are like, Cranberry, yeah, let's get on that. That's some good stuff right there. And Brody went and ate both Georgia's and Mason's, and I gave an extra one to Poncho. But Brody was all about that, wasn't he? Was that a tasty treat? I'm not supposed to give you that many in a day. I don't think, I'm pretty sure there's like a limit on here of how many. Oh wait, you're a large cat. I can give you three treats. So I'll give you another one later, Bobos. We already ate two. <laughs> and then Poncho over here. Little Mason, did you eat all your food again? Hey George. He's been eating all of his food. They all get the same amount of food. Ignore that hairball. <laughs> they all get the same amount of food. And they all make their own little individual messes over here. And then Mason eats it all and then just mopes. Mopes that he's got no food, huh? Are you just so hungry? I offered you a treat and you didn't want it. Good for your urinary tract. Huh, George? You're a brat too, you didn't want it either. We still need to get Mason a collar. You're naked. You're a naked boy. I'm gonna wait for the lazy one to wake up before we do Poncho's cake. But isn't this cute? It looks like it says Poncha, but it's Poncho. It's just the way that they got piped. Isn't that so cute? Where is he? Why are you smelling at the trash? We need to get a new trash can. That's gross. Come on, George. Here's your... You need a new collar, dude. This is gross. Look at this handsome boy in his birthday suit. Do you want to come get cake? Come get cake. Mariah Carey over here, the diva herself, required me to move her food before she would eat it. Because she doesn't eat in the presence of other people. But here's George, just watching him. Hanging out watching your brother. 